The best way to look at this is on board with Marcus Ambrose in the Pertec Ford. This is the approach to turn one. Hammer through the chicanes, the controversial chicane on the right at turn two across the curbing. Wakefield Street, look at the bumps here. They can sneak down the inside here at turn four. Over the curbing, everybody gets hungry on this part of the track. Rev limiter in second gear. East Terrace, turn five, bumps. Rev limiter, 7,500 RPM. Use the curb on the right. Slip up over the curb on the left. Right-hander now at seven. Using the exit curb. Bit of a breather, relax, gear shift. Now, start to brace yourself for the hard, fast run through the sweeper at turn eight. Better vision this year. The concrete wall has been moved back. Feather the throttle, slide out towards the wall. 240 k's, then a huge hot stop. One gear change for Marcus, back to second gear. Easy with the throttle application as you unfold 600 horsepower. Now behind the pits, left-hander. They've smoothed off the ripple strip on the right-hand exit. Fifth gear temporarily. Very easy to lock a front right brake here and it's also a passing opportunity for competitors. The final corner and coming back onto the pit straight. That's the Adelaide Parkland circuit for this Clipsal 500.